I'm on the TAC adapter right next to the computer, uh, since I do need to hook up to it. Uh, the black and the red wire, I'm going to run over to this side. Uh, black is ground and red, I need to go to my, my switch location off this relay here. And then what I did with those wires that were coming out of the computer, that I kind of had just running up there, um, up in this area here, is I took them, I put them into some of that corrugated stuff, and I ran them just back around the fender. You can see it's this wire here. And then I'm going to run those up behind the computer and make all my connections with the TAC adapter uh, behind this mount here. To hide the connections for the TAC adapter, they're all behind this bracket that I made for the, for the ECU. And that's them here, wired tied up. That's how everything looks. All done. Get the TAC adapter in place. Um, everything hooked up to my power, which is that relay there. Um, you know, I'm pretty happy with how it looks, I guess, outside of seeing those big ass connectors. I don't much care for that, but I, I don't know what else to do there. Um, maybe do something down the line, I don't know. But for now, it's for the most part done. Okay, I started doing some other things and that whole mess was just driving me nuts. So I took a couple hours and fabbed up a cover. Just made out of some scrap steel that I had from, uh, from work. Um, this is the piece there. They're throwing it out. I grabbed that kind of stuff. I'm lucky to have this real small homemade bar break that I acquired years ago, probably 30 years ago. Um, and that helps me do small things like, uh, like that. And this is it here. And what this will do is it will uh, basically screw on right here and then just cover that mess up. There, that looks way better. That's what the uh, box cover I made all painted up and on there. Looks pretty clean. Pretty happy with that.